Haunted dolls have been such a big phenomena for many scary and spooky stories all over the world. We are so familiar with the stories of Robert, Annabelle, Chucky, and many others that comes from United States of America. And some of them are just made up story to scare people. Believe it or not, Japan has one of the most surreal haunted doll story that revolves about love and affection. This particular story mentioned is about a doll named Okiku that allegedly grow human hair after her owner, who loves her very much, died. According to this real story, this particular doll was bought in Sapporo by a 17 years old Ikichi Suzuki in the year 1918 for his two years old sister named Okiku. He was visiting the area for a marine exhibit, but upon seeing the doll in a shop window, he knew at once that the doll needed to be bought and given to his sister. The doll stood about 40 cm tall and was dressed in a traditional kimono. The hair was black and cut to about shoulder length in a traditional Japanese style. The eyes were piercing like black beads pressed into a lifelike flesh of the face. When Ikichi returned home, he presented the doll to his little sister, whom fell in love with the doll immediately. The doll became Okiku's favourite toy and it seems to be her best friend. Okiku played with her doll every day and soon gave it the same name as herself, Okiku. The doll would never be out of Okiku's sight. Unfortunately, in 1919, Okiku passed away after a severe fever. She was only three years old. The doll was supposed to be buried along with Okiku, but due to some unforeseen circumstances, the doll was never placed with Okiku in her final resting place. The doll was instead placed on a family altar in commemoration of their daughter. Sometime later, the Suzuki family noticed that the doll's hair was getting longer. It once had a traditional shoulder length cut with neat end, but now the doll had hair reaching down towards the waist and the end were more random in length. Because of that, the family believed that the spirit of their own dead daughter inhabited the doll. The family had their hair tested in the lab the lab people said that it was indeed human hair. Suzuki family moved to a different town and they had placed the haunted doll at the Maneji Temple located at Hokkaido, where it has remained ever since. As time passes by, the hair continued to grow longer. Every year, the people of Japan hold a ceremony there in the memories of Okiku, where they will trim the doll's hair Nobody had ever been able to explain this phenomenon, but at the lab, they will be able to find out that the hair actually belongs to a young child, and that probably might be Okiku. Okay, cool.